Welcome back to Nippert Stadium where we get a little bit closer to September 5th. Tom Glitter, happy to be alongside once again UC Project Manager Bob Martin as progress all over the place here at Nippert. And Bob, let's start out on the east side where the stairs have now gone in, four staircases that'll take you to the 200 level from the 100 level. Of course, the bridge and the walkway have been there, but today for the first time, we see the view across the way from the 200 level. That's pretty sweet, isn't it? it so, is. uh, yeah, there's four stairways to get from the shank all the way down to the concourse if you want to do that. If you don't want to go down to the concourse, then you go, go over to the plaza and get what you need. Yeah, everybody up top moving fast and furiously to get that walkway and the bridges and the stairwells all done and then just steps away from that. Now we can really see restrooms, plenty of women's restrooms. There shouldn't be as much of a line as we have seen in the past, but restrooms are being finished, concession stands. All of those things are starting to look like they will in five or six weeks. We have definitely... Uh, excelled in that area of improving amenities. There's no doubt the women will be very happy about their more uh, facilities and, and even the men. Uh, and uh, a better distribution of concessions, both high and low. And so uh, what concerns me is that people may say, where's all the congestion? You know, That's so okay. it's kind of it's kind of a good and bad because we're we're setting this up so that there's not as much congestion, but yet the, the excitement of a, of a big game day. All right, head on over to the west side where top to bottom they're working two shifts to get ready for September 5th, paint, tile, you name it, everything's going on in that building. It is, uh, you know, we put the carpet down and then we cover it right up. So uh, on, on the images you see, you probably won't be able to, you know, really uh, appreciate the, the beauty of it and the, and, the, and the color contrast between the gray and the white. And uh, But yeah, millwork all over the place and, um, and tile and concession equipment, cooking equipment. Lots of, lots of work going on. One of the things that's spectacular that people probably won't appreciate till they're in there is all the little touches along the club area, along the mezzanine area where they put in tile before you go outside just to accent the whole look. That tile edge is, uh, is an architectural feature, but it's also a functional purpose for, you know, when it's inclement outside, we don't become traipsing in all the, all the grunge from the outside. So it's an easy place to clean as well. And it really, really makes a nice separation between sophistication and fun. Now, one of the spots that we've had an eye on since the first time it had any type of structure was the rooftop terrace. It's going to be a popular place for fans to watch the game. And we've seen it slowly take shape, but now the pavers are starting to go in, and boy, does it look great. All the clutter is uh, being removed. I remember all the cranes we had back up there, and uh, but that's all gone now. They're putting the pavers down, and the railings are going in, and we can see where the lighting, permanent light fixtures are going to be. The metal wall's up. Uh, it's a toasty little spot. It's it's going to be great for sunbathing. Although I don't think that's the the, permanent, the primary feature for the space, but uh, it'll it'll uh, it'll bring a lot of attention, a lot of action. All right, Bob might be the first sunbather out there. We'll keep an eye <laughs> on that situation, or maybe maybe we won't. Finally, let's go out to Bearcat Plaza because you talked about all that granite being brought back from Fishwick. That's not a small project. It's going great in that area. Really close to completion. It is. Uh, you know that top band of granite has re has returned. Uh, we're getting ready to. Uh, we got the trees secured, so we're getting ready to plant those in a, in a couple of weeks. But uh, the last thing in that area would be the uh, paver infills um, on the terrace roof itself. The railings are already going in, so uh, we're we're down to, to the last uh, you know few activities for that to 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 make a look and to open it up. Uh, yeah. But down below is the concession spaces, and those are already behind closed doors and. You know, all the uh, concession equipment's going in down there, too. So, All right, Bob, sounds good. Lots going on. Let's catch up again soon as you get a little bit closer to September 5th. All right, my pleasure. Good to see you. All right, that's Bob Martin. I'm Tom Glitter as we wrap up another Hard Hat Wednesday here on Bearcats TV.